guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and today I have a Target haul for you. I don't usually bring these to you, but I had a bunch of stuff and I thought I would share. I'm having some iced tea. My doctor says I have to drink less coffee. And that, my friends, is rude. But we do what we do. All right, this will be short and sweet, but I did want to share a few things with you. Like my buddy here, my little friend. He has decided that we're besties and I have to hold him all the time. That's what he's decided, right? Right, buddy? Excuse me. Hello. Can I put... All right, put you down. There you go. I picked up for $12. It's the three drawer little shelving, just a three drawer by, I think it's the Target brand up and up if I had to guess, but let's see. Oh, we have toys. Here, you want your toy? There you go. Um, and Alex is laying right next to us too, please don't worry. It is, yes, the uh, Room Essentials medium three door cart. It comes with wheels. Mine in my bathroom, I have a linen closet is broken and it keeps breaking more and I'm like, I just need to replace it. Excuse me, thank you. Um, speaking of my doctor, she wants me to have a little more fiber. Because of my keto diet, I don't need a ton of vegetables. But I was in the fiber department and I don't want to drink the fiber. But I've never bought gummies before because the sugar, but these are sugar free. I've never seen sugar free gummies. So I opened it because I had two already today. That's a serving and they're really good. They're fruity. So yeah, you get 90 chews and 45 servings because it's two chews per day. So I'll take those just to help you know, with a little fiber when we get old. Hi, sir. Um, I've been going a little crazy in the dollar spot like you do. But they came out with this sign, and it is the round. I don't, doesn't say. I would say it's 10 inches if I had to guess, and it's chalkboard on the back. But I'm going to use the back side to make a sign for my front door. And then this side is like um, distressed wood. So probably what I'm thinking of doing is making one sign on this one and one on this for like winter, fall, no, Christmas, and then winter, and I can just go from one way to the other and turn it. And then I will hang it on its string, um, and I'll make some kind of a greenery that can switch sides, and then that's easy for winter time. So I grabbed one of those. Um, oh, I picked up some, they had some of their Christmas candy out and I got these Dove caramels, just regular Dove milk chocolate with caramel in the middle. And I'm going to be using these for Christmas, some of them for a couple Christmas gifts. Oh, this is Hobby Lobby. My friend Teresa gave me these. She bought it and she didn't end up using it. And I think I will probably for Thanksgiving, just lay them out. But when I get bored with just laying them out, I can take them apart and spray paint them. So I thought that was cool. And it was very nice of her. She just gave them to me. Um, I think they were in the fall decor and they were $20 half off. So $10, I'm sure. Hi. Okay, back to Target. We got all kinds of stuff here, guys. Ooh, exciting stuff. Coffee. I bought, I like the um, Good and Gather brand, and this is toasted almond caramel, and this is salted caramel. Apparently, I was in a caramel mood. So, I grabbed one of each. I just throw these in my freezer until I'm ready for them, and it keeps them fresh. A little bit longer, and they were on sale two for ten. And then getting ready for Christmassy time, I got some Icebreaker sugar-free candy cane mints. So I grab those for me. So these are gonna go into the freezer. I'll put those over here. Um, this is, could be exciting. And it could not be, I can't remember. Oh yeah, Q-tips. Don't we all need Q-tips in our life? Oh, in the dollar spot, they have these two packs. And I feel like they have these at the Dollar Tree as well. 
and you get seven yards total. And I thought, you know, for Christmas wrapping, this is, should be enough to get me through the Christmas wrapping season. Um, I have tried using Dollar Tree tape and I just don't think it holds very well. So I prefer like a Scott brand. So I grabbed two of those and then they have these fun paper cutters for gift wrapping and this one just says ho, ho, ho. But also, fun fact, this is a letter opener. So you can also use it to open your mail. And they're $1 and they're great. So I grabbed that. Also in the $1 section, I grabbed two more of the, one more of this one. Um, I don't believe this would hold a gift card, but I'm giving some cash money to some young people. And um, yeah, I figured I'll put them in here. I also got Dollar Tree gift card holders, so I'm between them, I will have enough for the monies that I'm giving. I thought that was pretty cool. Oh, look what I found in the candy section. They are Tootsie Roll snowballs. They are candy covered Tootsie Rolls. Like what is happening in my life? Obviously I'm not eating these, but they're gonna be gifted to somebody who will appreciate them in her stocking. So I grabbed that. Oh, in the dollar spot, I found a snowflake which I'm wondering if I need to buy a couple more snowflakes if I find them. I've only ever seen this one and they're a dollar a piece. Um, again, for winter time. So I grabbed just this one for now because that's all I saw. And Oh, hold on to your hat guys. You know, I love these impressed nails, right? I found them in the Christmas print. Oh, the upside down. Those are reindeer at the bottom, and then those are just like candy cane stripes, and then the red gold. I think that's just candy cane. Yep, red and white striped. You get 30 in a pack, and I can wear these for almost a solid two weeks. Now, towards the end, they do start popping off, but you get 30 in a pack, so I can change them out. And this one, you're not gonna see real well because it's kind of hidden, but this little one here is a Christmas tree, and then these just have jewels on them. This is white pearl and gold. So between these two packs, I should be able to have my nails done for Christmas all the month of December. So I'm super excited about that, right? Because fa la la. And I will tell you, I went to a different Target than I normally go to. It does have the, the Ulta experience in there. But yeah, I grabbed the last one with the reindeer and there was two left of this and that was it. Now, if I see more, I may just wear them for a week and switch them out for the whole month. Who knows? But for right now, I'm impressed. And these are the limited edition, the Christmas I get short. So you see the top there, the S. I get the short. The longer ones, I just can't really function well. So I found those. I was so excited. I was even looking on their website and couldn't find them. They weren't out yet on the Impress Nail website. And I did see some on oh, Amazon, but they were like $20 a set. So I think people buy them up every year and then resell them, I'm assuming. And then we just have a couple things in here. I grabbed this black blanket. Um, it's a woven throw and you know, I'm doing the black and red. So I have to keep a cover on my ottoman because somebody's cats scratch it. So this will be my ottoman cover and it was only $5. And I think I would leave this out for a little while after, but it's super soft and they had them in several colors, but I liked with the white detail. So I grabbed that and oh, some more of the ornaments I found was this one, and I have a like a shadow box in my kitchen, I'm thinking these are gonna go in, but it's like a letter to Santa, and it actually can hold a letter, it's metal. Just says Santa mail, and then this is just a sack of reindeer feed, and it's stuffed. They're just ornaments, but you can use them for package toppers, you can use them, like for me, in a little shadow box, in a small tiered tray, like the one behind me, the target size, is a small one. This These types of things would fit in there perfectly. And I liked them, so I grabbed them, the snowflake as well. I know they have other things in that collection, I just haven't seen them. Oh, I'm obsessed with peppermint lip balms, so I got the Burt's Bees in the peppermint candy cane, I think. Well, peppermint. 
So I grabbed two because I like them and this should last me a couple months. All right, the last things I got. So Sarah and I on Thanksgiving are gonna do some crafty crafts. Christmas ornamenty stuff. And I found these little kits and we're gonna do them because apparently we're 12. But this comes with everything you need to make that bulb right there, including the beads and the little houses. And that's what the kit looks like. This is what the kit looks like. So you have a bulb that will sit or hang. You've got your snow in here, the little houses, some glue, the twine, a needle even to put your beads on. Like everything you need is in here. Now, if you wanted to do like a hot glue, that's separate. And then I got this one that has the little front door on it with a reed, a little mini reed. I also saw the one with the red truck, but it's natural. And they had one with a deer in it. If you're a Starbucks, if you're a Starbucks, if you're a Harry Potter fan, the deer. Alex has passed out behind me. So I grabbed these for us to do. And then I grabbed a couple other little kits for us to do. I will show you all of the things. So to get myself ready for Christmas, mint candy cane chapstick and my mints. But I think that's everything I bought. Oh, it is not. One moment. I'm back. I got this shelf. This is a pretty substantial shelf. It is a sled. It has the um, sawtooth hanger on the back so you can hang it. You can lean it, sit it up against something. And each of these, you can display something fun. And I, I really like this. And I'm wondering, only if it was navy blue. I could leave it out year round. Can I make that navy blue? Absolutely. Am I going to? Probably not. And quite frankly, I love green too. So, and I'm wondering if I can leave this out through winter. We'll see where it lands in my house. Now, this was the last thing I bought. And I think I've gotten so far pretty much the things that I wanted that came out, except for I would like a few more. I mean, honestly, you could set these little ornaments in here. And I love the how the white pops, you know, pops off, but they fit. They fit on these little shelves. So I'm just kind of on the hunt. There are a couple more of these little ornaments I would like to get. I can tell you which one nobody wants is the little wooden toy airplane because I keep finding that everywhere, but not the snowshoes or these other ski lodge type things. And I have plenty of time. It's literally Halloween. But that is all of the things I've collected over the last couple weeks at Target while they're rolling out their Christmas selection. So I hope you enjoyed and you have a good one. I will talk to you later. Bye.